Welcome to our viewing deck. I hope you are sitting comfortably. Whilst Egypt is home to the most fascinating man-made ancient wonders and treasures in the world, the most beautiful of its treasures were placed here by the hand of Mother Nature. The National Park of Ras Mohammed is a protected area covering 345 kilometers underwater, and there are over 40 dive sites along the coast, and it is forbidden to fish these waters in order to protect the reefs and the rich, diverse ecosystem here. Here we have reached an area known as Ras Kati. This is one of the most famous places to dive and snorkel in the National Park, as this area is home to many different species of hard and soft coral, and of course, colorful fish. So what is a coral reef? A coral reef is a community of living organisms. It is made up of plants, fish and many other creatures. Reefs need sunlight to survive and only exist in warm temperatures. Different corals, plants and seagrass give food and oxygen to the animals that live on the reef. Coral reefs are some of the most diverse ecosystems in the world. They are home to about 25% of all marine life. There are sponges, sea slugs, oysters, clams, crabs, shrimp, sea worms, starfish and sea urchins, jellyfish and sea turtles and many other species of fish and marine life. Think of them as the rainforests of the oceans. Here in the Red Sea, we have over 1,200 species of fish, 10% of which are unique to this body of water, which means that you will not see them anywhere else in the world. Most of the species of fish you can spot here today can be identified on your fish card. But some of the most popular are the blue and yellow angelfish, the butterfly fish, the lionfish, and you may even spot stingrays and eels if you look carefully. And of course, you will get the chance to find Nemo. Can you spot the orange and white clownfish? There's a good chance he won't get lost here. Did you know that fish can recognize each other from the patterns on their scales? Why are reefs important? Coral reefs do a number of amazing things. Protect shorelines from big waves by absorbing wave energy. Provide a safe place for fish to breed. Provide habitats for a large variety of organisms. Provide food, fish and shellfish for many people living along coastlines. Are a source of medication, some anti-cancer drugs and painkillers come from reefs. Coral reefs are fragile ecosystems. They are very sensitive to any changes. Worldwide, coral reefs are disappearing for a number of reasons. The reefs we see today have been growing over the past 5,000 to 10,000 years. And we all need to do our bit to make sure they are still around for another 10,000 years. Which is why we support the conservation of our reefs. What can you do to help? Follow some of these simple rules. Do not remove any marine life from its natural habitat or shells. Do not step on or touch coral. Do not buy souvenirs made from anything which lives in the sea. Take nothing, living or dead, out of the sea, except garbage. Take nothing into the sea and leave nothing behind. So, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, sit back, relax and enjoy a diver's eye view of our beautiful reefs.